question six. So here we've got constant acceleration, so it's just using the SUVAT formulas. So these are the four SUVAT formulas that I use. Um, I know there is a fifth one, but I tend to just focus on these four, as all, all questions can be answered just using these four. So for part A, I know the time taken is five seconds. I know my final velocity is, te is 10 meters per second. I know the distance covered is 40 meters and I need to work out the acceleration. Now, because I don't use that fifth formula, I need to do this in a couple of goes. I, ca I can't do it directly in one go, which you could do if you use that fifth formula. So anyway, the way I've done it, I've started off, off by using S equals U plus V times T over two, allowing me to work out that my U is six. Then I can mo move over and use V equals U plus AT, allowing me to work out that my acceleration is 0.8. Now for part B, I know that S is 20, A is 0 0.8, I've just worked that out, and U is 6, I've just worked that out. So using S equals UT plus half AT squared, I end up with this simultaneous equation here, which I've just popped into my, um, my calculator to get uh, an answer of 2.81 seconds.